Hello. Today we're going to look at the utility scent discrimination exercise. The principal part of this exercise is that your dog go directly out to the article pile, find the scented article, and bring it directly back to you. He has to do this once with a leather scented article and once with a metal scented article. Should your dog do both of these um, retrieves, scent discrimination retrieves, he will have qualified. Let's look at the equipment you will need to do the scent discrimination exercise in AKC Utility. Um, you will need 10 articles, 5 leather, 5 metal. These are the conventional style of articles. Um, you do not have to use these conventional type articles. You can use any household items, but the five metal must all be the same. The five leather must all be the same. The leather and the metal do not have to be the same. So, for example, you could use five metal mason jar lids for or five juice cans. Um, and then for the leather, you might want to use five sandals, but the five sandals must be all alike. The five mason jar lids must all be alike. Secondly, it stipulates in the AKC regulations that the articles be clearly numbered. Here are the ones. Um, they do not have, <coughs> excuse me, they do not have to be consecutive numbers. Uh, you can have any numbers on there you like, um, just as long as the judge can read them clearly so that she can mark her score, score sheet with the proper number when it's placed out in the pile when you are performing. Now, generally when you buy articles, the conventional set, you will get a set of 12. That's pretty basic. Um, that is so that you have enough articles, clean articles, for two days. The first day that you are going to do the scent discrimination in utility, you would take out two unused articles and place them aside by your equipment, by your setup. Um, these would be used the next day in lieu of the ones you're going to use today. Today, let's say um, I'm going to use the threes. Once I was through with these, with my performance, I would take these threes, put them aside, and take the clean ones, put them in my bag, and I would then be able to have a clean set for the next day. They would be, there would be no scented, freshly scented articles um, in my bag for the following performance. Okay, thank you. Okay, now, when I hand <clears throat> my bag of articles to the ring store, the gate store, um, I do not pick the articles that I'm going to use that day. The judge and the judge alone will indicate which articles will be used that day. Uh, so, I just hand over the set of ten, five metal, five leather, to the gate steward, and uh, the judge will either choose them or have me choose them. Now, um, I don't have a gate steward or a judge here, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to pick two articles. Okay, I picked the number three leather, the number three metal, and what will happen once the two articles are chosen by the judge, the judge, without handling them, will place them on a chair in the ring for my use when that exercise comes up during the course of my run. So the two, cent uh, two articles that I will be using will be placed on the chair. When it's time to do the exercises themselves, and they are considered two separate exercises, by the way, um, the ring store will then place the other eight remaining articles in a pile 20 feet away from where I will be sending my dog. So 20 feet away, approximately, the articles will be dumped and they will be placed six inches apart, which is approximately the size of a dollar bill. Now, I don't want to touch the bar. My dog is trained to scent the bar. 
um, I place my articles approximately six inches apart. Or the ring stort would do that. And uh, I would and then I would be indicating to my dog that the pile is there. This is Dax, and he's going to be the first one to help me uh, demonstrate the uh, scent discrimination exercise. Um, when the ring sort is putting out those articles that I just demonstrated for you, uh, approximately 20 feet away and six, inch six inches apart, the ring stort will touch each of the articles. While the ring stort is doing that, I will have my dog facing that pile. I would even be indicating to my dog, there's your articles or there's your find mine or whatever your command is for your dog that you've trained him to do. You wait. <laughs> I know. Um, <clears throat> I want my dog to know where those articles are and that this exercise is the one we're going to do. Utility is extremely complicated and the dog must learn to work away from you he needs confidence I don't I want to help my dog succeed every step of the way as much as I'm allowed within the AKC regulations um, once the articles are placed out there I would then turn my dog away from the pile and select an article the article that I choose to use as in the first part the first exercise is of my own choice. I can choose a leather, I can choose the metal. It is my choice. The judge does not tell me which one to use. Um, I would then take that article and scent it with my back to the article pile. And once I have scented it, I would present it to, to the judge. Whereupon the judge would ask me if I was ready. Now, while I'm scenting, the judge will ask me how I will send my dog. This is important. The judge will ask me each time, because remember each, each, honey, you lay down, lay down. He's getting antsy. Because each exercise is an individual exercise unto itself. Um, so each time the judge will ask me how I will send my dog. Now there are two ways you may send your dog. You may send your dog directly, or you may send them after a sit. If I send my dog directly, and I'm going to show you all three methods, I mean all three styles. There are only two methods, after a sit or send directly. If I'm going to send directly, my dog cannot sit when I turn. If I'm going to turn after a sit, I may turn to the left or I may turn to the right to send my dog. When I make that turn, the dog should sit. Um, I would then give the second command of find my article, you know, whatever my command is. Uh, I'll show you this all step by step. This is an overview. Right now, Dax and I are going to do a leather article and we are going to turn and sit to the right. You ready? Thank you. Let's do it.